Welcome to Sticks Picks for the Interactive Classroom. I'm Andy Sticks, and today I'd like to talk to you about five tips to enhance communication when dealing with confrontation. The most important thing that a principal wants to do with his or her staff, or a teacher wants to do with his or her students, is to build trust. And what we have noted lately is that social skills have been declining due to emails and texting and basically kids not playing with each other after school in terms of having play dates as they grow up. They're sitting in front of computers a lot. And what does a teacher do or what does a principal do when dealing with confrontation? Well, when somebody comes at you, they come at you aggressively, the first thing to do is, one, take a deep breath. Breathe in and breathe out because they're trying to fluff your feathers. So this will give you a moment and then think about the situation and think about it positively and try to reframe it. If they're coming at you with a negative statement, you don't want to basically absorb that negativity because it's going to um, infringe upon your ability to process your own language. So reframe it into a positive statement and say, you know what, I'm really glad you brought that up. Let's talk about it. This, in turn, will start to communicate to them that you're willing to listen to them and that you really care and you're trying to build trust. So look at their body language and read it. And look at your own body language. Smile and thank them. Try to show them that you're open to communicate. Once you've started to have your conversation and you want to say certain things to them, make sure that you use brevity. State your piece and then be patient.